Hi, we're Midgard Lobster, and this is Alice Madness Returns. This is um, America McGee's second Alice game, and it's... I think it's probably one of my favorite games ever. And so much better looking than the other one, just al already I can tell. Yeah. So, um, we're gonna skip the question until later in this video, so just... Strap in! Be prepared for Alice-ness. Alice-ry. Alissery? <laughs> I don't know, man. Just kind of hyped. It's a key. Many keys. It's a man key. It was. Come now, Alice. It's only a dream. It's not a dream, it, it's a memory. And it makes me sick. Now, focus. Wait, you're floating again. Weightless. A cipher. Relax. Fire! Uh, I'm in hell! Forget it. Abandon that memory. It's unproductive. Go to Wonderland. I'm trapped in my past. Sergeant, this girl's badly burned. Call for a doctor. She'd be all right. <gasps> no, Alice. Discard that delusion. Forget it. Go to Wonderland. I'd rather not, Doctor. My Wonderland's shattered. It's dead to me. Your preference doesn't signify, girl. Now, Alice. Where are you? I'm sailing with a friend. Hmm. It's different somehow. Things have changed. Change is good. It's the first link in the chain of forgetting. What's happening? Are you mad? I'm not mad. Rabbit. That's not right. What's he doing there? Is something wrong? Something wrong? Robert! Oh no. Not that. Don't struggle, Alice. Let the new Wonderland emerge. Pollution. Corruption. It's killing me. Wonderland is destroyed. My mind is in ruins. Forget it, Alice. Block that dream. Wake at the sound. Better now, aren't we? My head's exploded and there's a steam hammer in my chest. Yes, well, the cost of forgetting is high. My memories make me vomit. What can I... Remember other things. I want to forget. Who would choose to be alone, imprisoned by their broken memories? I'll set you free, Alice. Memory is a curse more often than a blessing. So you've said many times, and... And I will say again, the past must be paid for. Now... Before our next session, collect those pills from our High Street chemist. Very well, Doctor. It's a doctor. But it's so. my turn to forget, Alice. Now, Charlie. Your pa was hung for killing your ma who beat you. Let's forget that, shall we? The past is dead, Charlie. That guy seems like kind of a hack. Uh, early 19th century psych psychiatrist? Pretty sure, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Alright, so, yeah, um, on that note, we have a question. Who is best pony? Uh, what's his name? Bannerl Cabbage Patch? Nah, nah, Borderlands computer game. <laughs> do, do, do you mean Wimbledon tennis match? Uh, Benny Boop Cumberbop. And did you get Coogee Batch? Buffalo Custard Bath. What was it not Rat Machine Cracker Jack? No, okay, I got it. It's it's Benedict Cumberbatch. He's best pony. Dude, no, <laughs> that's, that that name just sounds wrong. I think we're remembering it wrong. Has to be. What are you drawing? Doctor, do you right? Still sick in the head? 
I'm past a cure. Terminal condition. What? <laughs> Gonna die from insanity. <laughs> I mean, I guess that technically can happen. So yeah, this game is like more a game than a mod on an Unreal Engine like the other one was. <laughs> <clears throat> the illustrated news feeds an insatiable appetite for domestic mayhem and indust industrial disaster. Fire at the match factory. Six girls missing. Is there anything more predictable? The world's gone quite mad. Fire oh, at mad the match here. factory though. And you look like... I don't even know what the fuck you look like. You look horrifying. They have weak necks. Regular person. Horrifying monstrosity. <laughs> and they have weak necks. Earn your keep. Mr. Payne had no what? idea how humble a home could be. If not for my drawings and the photographs, this could pass for my room at the asylum. Hey, it's all that stuff from the other game. There's the Queen's Maze. Yeah. The chess pieces, the... the I don't know what the hell that is. Uh, the guy with the red axe on his forehead. Don't you remember him? Yeah. Red axe forehead, man. Right, very much so. There's um, Tweedledum and Tweedledee. There's um, Big Nose Hat Man. <laughs> no, sorry, the Mad Hat. Mushroom Kingdom. I'm telling you, man. Mario Dystopia confirmed. Everything is a Mario Dystopia. Yeah. This photograph of my family was delivered here by post. No message, no return address. I'm grateful for this memento, but I wish I could thank the sender. It was ghosts. <laughs> it was ghosts? Yep. Alright. Picture sending ghosts. So I'm guessing we have to go out to the chemist. What a bunch of little shits. Yeah. Another day, a different dream perhaps. So there, welcome to Industrial Age London. Nice, looks very really happy and not bleak at all. No, but the genie. <laughs> How about basketball? Where's her flat? Too good for company. She don't get close. Hates being touched. Who likes it then? Never slap. Fight more like. What the shit is wrong with these kids? I don't know. Right oh. That's fucking weird. Uh. Oh hello. A mangy cat. Yeah. Hey, free or not free meat? I guess he's selling it, but yeah. Meat. Oh, good God! I would not buy a thing from that man. Why? Look at him. He's cool. He looks like a fucking caricature of um, uh, our Santa Claus's dad. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And he eats people. True. Hello, puss. Puss, 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 puss. Don't be afraid. Good lord, people look horrifying. <laughs> you look at this, this guy though. He just looks like. Dude, you know what he reminds Jesus me of? Fuck. There's this one like super racist caricature of a Jewish man. It reminds me of that. I'll teach him. Beat him good. Alright. It's the white cat. Uh. There he went. Now, where has that cat gone? Oh, free skull? Can you get the free skull? All living things die eventually. Still, a creature's remains are always poignant. Okay. Oh, look, a streetwalker. Yeah. She what? looks very healthy. Very healthy. I've seen skeletons with more flesh than you. Yep. Like a real job. No change in nappies. Better than being a dog's body for orphan, you can make someone happy. Save the world, ten minutes at a time. Did he just offer you a job? As a prostitute, yeah. Nice. You look like a discerning gent. Alright, fuck you then, you can't fucking afford it anyway! 
you said fuck you, then you can't fucking afford it anyway. <laughs> All right. <laughs> this is a, this is a... creatures into dark holes has become a habit. I hope it's not a vice. <laughs> <laughs> well, this uh, is a Christian channel. I don't know if we can keep playing this game with all these streetwalkers and stuff. Yeah, and and all these swear words. Yeah, all these motherfucking swears. Thank God we're not a Christian chandler, though. Shut up. <laughs> that guy scares me, though. Yeah, that guy scares me too. What's going on? That's some Innsmouth shit right there. My stars and garters, Alice Little. Slumming again, are we? Nurse Witless. <laughs> what luck. Twice in as many months. Out on your own? You look frazzled, dearie. Not doing well? Not really. Come along home then and look at my pigeons. Pretty birds. Like you. I don't think so. Our last visit cost me several pounds and got me nowhere. I might recall where your mangy rabbit got to. What? Still a mess. No surprise. Her kin roasted like chestnuts right before her eyes. Ten years in Rutledge Asylum wasted everyone's time. Dr. Bumby won't do better. Still hauling out her questions. The fire, her memory. I deserve consideration, don't I? Who found her her new clothes? Who got her a place at Bombay's? Where'd she be without me? On the street, selling her backside. Like some pigeons, though. She's doled out the odd pound or two. But what I know is worth more than that. Kept her secret, haven't I? Heard her say, all died on my account, I couldn't save you. I've told her my silence is for sale. Cheap. I'm a good sort, really. Not like her nanny, that uppity whore. Or that lawyer fellow Radcliffe took her stupid rabbit. Need money. Warned her I'd tell the coppers if she didn't make a donation to my upkeep. She yells and goes off her head. Does she can't remember her name, what I heard. What a lovely person. Yeah. Seems like she knows a bunch of nice people, this Alice. Mm hmm. Lucky girl. Look at these pillars of smog. Lovely. Nice. A coop is really just a cage, but the birds don't seem to mind. How would you know, though? They don't seem to mind. But how would you know if they did? How do birds what? show their. Uncomfort is the thing I'm thinking. Like well, you wouldn't not really know, there. would you? Not, yeah, not coming back. I guess. True. Yeah. Nurse Witness, do you mean to help me to send me back to the asylum? I won't say no. I've a thirst you could photograph. Need a drink. Your mouth so needs washing. Does have cool hallucinations though. She has the best hallucinations. Yeah. Freaking awesome to be honest. Very upsetting journey, but I'm rid of Pris or whatever she's become. At least the place I've landed is somewhat familiar. 
About time, too, Alice. Blasted cat. Don't try to bully me. I'm very much on edge. Perfect. When you're not on edge, you're taking up too much space. <laughs> you're no help at all. But you know I can be. I'll frighten myself. When necessary, thanks very much. I was hoping to escape from all that. Abandon that hope. A new law reigns in this wonderland, Alice. It's very rough justice all round. We're at risk here. You be on your guard. We'll be fine. It'll be fine. We toppled the last tyrant, we can topple the new tyrant. So yeah, we have double jump this time. Oh, nice. And the controls are smooth, not floaty. Oh, nice. There's also a cowbird. A curd? <laughs> yeah, we can call that a curd if you want to. It's a curd. You're a curd. <laughs> Ooh, a free house. It's a memory. Oh, God, well, Alice, I swear, you jump so well. Are you sure it's not a house? It looks like a house. It's a memory. Oh. Oh. Thanks. Oh. <laughs> Did not realize. This place is pretty and less terrifying than most other places in this place. Hey, it's this place. Oh. But her statue is crying again. We fixed that last time. We did, but make her. We need to make her uncrying. Twirl, twirl. Yeah. yeah Another memory. memory. I mean, house. You from that table again, Alice. I'll expire. You're two times too reckless, my girl. James. It's probably a, yeah, a launch mushroom. The launch room. <laughs> and the oh, scurry at Alice is merely a stinky toadstool. A spongy consistency, but poisonous. Okay. How do I. I don't remember how to get into those. Uh, you probably need mushrooms. Like edible ones that make you taller or bigger or something. Yeah. Quite possibly. There we go. There it is. Oh, is that drugs that make you... Yeah, what does it say? Sprinkle... No, drink me. I've been down this road before. Good things in small packages? Though lacking a bathing costume, a plunge in that pool is in order. My god. I'm shrinking in this potion. Shall I disappear? Nah. Almost. But the upside is that while smaller, you can see things that are nearly invisible to your bigger self. Ah, I get it. Quite. Forests for the trees. Just the other way round. Short-sighted is more than a matter of perspective. What's that? A lot of memory. Look at like. Hold left control to shrink. Oh. So you can do it on command. That's yep. so cool. Look how small she's become. All curled up. She's barely there. A vixen in her hidey hole. Should we go back and check out the things we couldn't check out before? We need to. Yeah. Yeah, while shrunk, Alice gains shrink sense. Nice. <laughs> that was funny. But yeah, you can see um the purple stuff. I'm guessing. Oh, what? Uh, oh, teeth? Yeah. Why did that flower have teeth? That's fucking weird. Uh, teeth are, if I remember correctly, currency. Ah, okay. So, so Alice lives with a bunch of Warhammer orcs. Basically, yeah. Oh. That's a big ass fucking snail. And also a very stationary snail. I mean, a tree crew on its back. <laughs> Damn. How long do you have to hang out for that to happen? Quite a while, I'm guessing. <laughs> it's alright. It tells me it's, I'm supposed to go here. Inside the keyhole. Oh, it's telling like me to stab demons. Yeah, thing is, I don't have my knife yet. 
That we can't stab demons. We cannot. Can I? No. Tells me there's a memory here. Oh, yeah, right there. I'll never have more fun alone than when I rode the big slide in Hyde Park. Papa will take you soon, Alice. Hmm. Whoa. Do we turn to a golf ball there, or no, just slide? Like slide. <laughs> <laughs> All right then. I like that that joke keeps popping up somehow. Mm-hmm. Did not expect it to happen ever after the Dark Souls series, but it follows us around, man. It does. It's been in almost every series so far, so far. Yeah. Yeah. Oh sh shit! It's getting slightly creepy. I like it. Uh, nothing. Good. That river has blood. That looks like the Jabberwocky. Oh. Yeah. It is. It's the Deaderwocky. The Vorpal Blade is swift and keen and always ready for service. I've not come back here looking for a fight. Really? That's a pity. One's certainly looking for you. That knife is gorgeous, though. The Vorpal Blade goes snickersnack. It leaves him dead, as seen in a previous poem. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Oh. But yeah, that's definitely the Jabberwock. Yep. It inflicts the swiftest damage to a single target at close range. Hmm. So it's kind of a... By Jabber Melee disassembler, I guess. Teeth. And we got a rose. <clears throat> yes, actual combat animations, so good. Flight or yeah. fight implies a permanent choice. But flight often just means putting off the fight to another day. Choose your battles wisely, Alice. Hmm? Can you still throw it? No. That's ah, okay though. We can't do this. Oh, nice. You can capture butterflies and stick them to your feet. It's cool. Quite so. Also, there are no butterflies. No, when you held it, there were butterflies on your feet. Hello, Insidious Ruin. It's black goo monsters. Yeah. Alright. Can not load its head. Oh. Wow, the combat has evolved. Yep. It's actual combat. Yep. And not just trash <laughs> not just FPS combat with weapons that don't wanna that really don't wanna like <laughs> super don't wanna don't get me wrong the last game was cool but this already this looks like it's gonna be so much better glasses A flower's purpose is simple and immutable human purpose is fickle because it is a slave to memory Memories must be strictly managed, Alice. Unproductive ones must be eliminated. Uh, what? That's not how that works, my dude. No, it isn't. But yeah, butterflies? Oh, yeah, yeah those check things. them out. These are the type of butterflies that don't freak me out. I'm mostly freaked out by moths and like... The ones that have large torsos? Yeah, I get it. I don't know, they, they seem shifty. Something's off about them. They seem shifty. Yeah. Hey kid. <laughs> hey kid. You wanna buy some dust? <laughs> wanna buy some nectar, man? While jumping, float. To further extend float, press and hold spacebar again while jumping. Dude, were you on Discord at the time when I freaked the fuck out when there was a butterfly? I think you were. 
Oh wow, you can do that m many times? Oh, you can re-trigger it. Or... Oh, wow. That's cool. Nice. But were you on Discord at the time I freaked out when a moth went into my window? I don't remember, and honestly. And I killed it with a empty can and people thought I was being murdered or something. <laughs> I don't think so, no. Okay, that's... Yeah, that's kind of the story of it. It was hilarious for everyone for, but me, basically. I freaked the fuck out. Collect Ooh, bottle? bottle. It has your name on it. It yes, does. It's yours. And it has a picture of your necklace on it, too. Where's your necklace? Mm -hmm. What's that? That's the Duchess. Oh, you remember yeah. we killed her? It was, she was like the first boss in the second game. Is she game? undead? In the first game. No, everything came back alive. In the Are last cutscene. Are you sure they're not just super clean it's zombies? It's you again, Alice. You may approach. Why would I do that? You want to eat me? Yes, well, you taught me manners. And I've lost my taste for mad women. Strictly a poor sign diet for me. Everything's better with bacon, don't you agree? Of course you do. <laughs> now, there are pig snouts scattered about. I heard a few behind the house. Go fetch them for me. But take care for the pests that block your way. Pepper them up if they do. They need spice. And you're just the dick, a girl, to season them for me. You'll find that grinder serviceable. Why not season your own pig parts? Matter of priorities. My alabaster skin needs protection from the disgusting creatures running amok amidst the environs. But one gets peckish. Look, all you have to do is listen for the oink, then shoot the snout. You may like the results. I certainly will. She's hot, though. <laughs> Damn, man. Gotta get me some of that. You've just obtained the Duchess's Piglet Edition Pepper Grinder. Spice up your foes. Prepare savory snouts. Cool. Or something. Yeah, I don't want to use it. How do we... That's closed. Yeah. We probably need more snouts to open that. A butterfly. Oh? Dude, that's fucking amazing! Mm -hmm. Let's overheat it. Can we get a better cooling mechanism for it somehow or something like that? Yeah, we can upgrade weapons. Nice. I fucking love upgrading weapons, man. Which is why I was sad when I played, like for a bit when I played Ratchet and Clank for the first time, because I, I was so behind on that. Like I played it for the first time, what, 2000, um, 2010, probably something like that. Damn. Yeah. And I was like, I've been missing out my entire life. This is glorious. Gods, baby. Spook, baby. I shot him. <laughs> what? Mm -hmm. <laughs> Throughout every domain, keep an ear out for snouts. Enter aiming mode and shoot the snout with the pepper grinder. Once the snout is full of pepper, it will re reveal paths and collectibles. What? Yep. That is fucking insane and awesome. Yeah, that's this game in a nutshell, by the way. All right. Let's um let's shoot you full of pepper. Yeah boy. Does it sneeze out the path you need to take? Oh it just does its thing. Oh it flies back home to her, so he basically collected it for her. By peppering it. That makes about as much sense as any other thing in this game though. Yeah. Thank you so much for the snout. Now go away. <laughs> wow. Uh, it's a picnic basket. Can I go back? Oh, damn it. No, you need to break it for a reward. Bunch of teeth. That door opens. Can I 
go go back out there. No. Okay. Well, maybe later. I don't know. Yeah, and later is exactly what we'll do. See you next time. Goodbye.